Uh, I got paranoid, first of all, because it scared me. It was just all of a sudden uh, he hit me from the side, and I, w I was at the school parking lot picking up my daughters. So, uh, I got real nervous. I didn't know what to do. Uh, my wife wanted to tell me, let's call I just got hit.com. And that's what I did. Well, the next day I started getting sore. And she was saying that uh, with this not being your fault, you might as well, you know what I mean, get you some help and uh, pursue the uh, uh, settlement, or try to anyway. And that's what I did. So that's what I did. Uh, neck injury and uh, a little back injury. But mostly it was in my neck and I was having uh, migraine headaches as well from the accident. Uh, if I was going to get anything out of it and how long the procedure was going to take, if it was going to take real long, and how much of my time I was going to have to take out of my day to do things to get it done. And I realized I didn't have to do much. Uh, it didn't take out a lot of my time out of my day and it was real convenient. Uh, and after I went through the process and finished uh, doing my therapy, Erica turned me over to the negotiator, which was uh, Angie. And me and Angie touched bases pretty much once a week. And she kept me informed on what was going on. Uh, she didn't hide any problems that, that she ran into. Uh, everything was honest and truthful. And, uh, at the time, I was worried about my bills, so there was like, Yes, thank you, you know what I mean? And the amount, I really didn't expect this much amount, so I was real shocked. I guess that's the biggest word. Shocked and happy at the same time. Even with the communication lines, you know, even when they were busy, like I stated on the form, they called me back like they said they would.